Matthew Swinnerton here from Event Santa Cruz, and I am here with Connor Gard. How are you doing, Connor? Good. How are you? Good. Thanks for taking the time to do the interview. No problem. So I want to talk to you, of course, about an experience that happened last night at the harbor with these 12 young, young ones. Uh, but before, I want to talk about you. So you're a photographer, 15 years old already at 15, you're doing work of a 50 year old photographer. I mean, it's amazing to work. Um, what kind of photography do you do? I try to do everything when it's surfers, sunsets, sunrises, nature. That's basically it. And you live in the perfect place to do that. <laughs> okay. So, um, Connor, what happened last night? You, you have a firsthand experience and we're going to play the video as well after this interview. But, um, what did you see last night? So I was shooting my buddies at the Harbor, which is a very rare break. Like it's pretty, pretty rare. And it doesn't break very often. So, and there was a big swell. That's what it, it's bigger than usual right it, now. The, the waves, right? Yeah. Yeah. Some people say it's the biggest swell of the decade. That's crazy. crazy. So, so, so what do you see? Yeah. So what I saw, I saw a chain of sailboats coming in with a tow, with a boat towing them. They came in at a pretty big set. So what, what's happening is the harbor is breaking very wide. So it's breaking right where the entrance where they came in is. So what they did is as they were coming in, a big wave came. So there was a bunch of whitewash coming towards them and then it knocked them over. And how, well, like they, they got knocked over, obviously probably not the best day to be out there sailing. No. Yeah, I know. And from reports, many of the people that were watching them were like, okay, this is crazy. They yeah. shouldn't have, you know, be out doing that right now with these sets. Um, how did they get to safety? So the surfers saw what happened. And they immediately, one guy caught a wave as it was happening, came right over. Everybody was yelling who was watching. Everybody was yelling at the surfers to go over. And they came right away. So the kids were knocked off. They had life vests on so they could, they could float. But... It, it seemed to be that they weren't very good at swimming. So the surfers, and these kids are young too. These kids look to be maybe nine, around nine years old. Oh, really? Oh, man. It was pretty crazy. So these surfers got them, put them on their board, put them on their backs, made, made sure they were, just, they, they were safe, and they brought them to shore. Man, was there a group of people watching? Was this like a tense there was situation? Every, it was probably like 500 people all. Where There was people on the jacks. There was people on the jetty. There was people on the beach. They were all yelling. And I bet and there was a couple people. I saw called 911. And then later fire engines came. So it was pretty crazy. Well, thank goodness that Santa Cruz surfers were there. Yep. Okay, well, hey, thanks so much for, you know, for capturing this video. We're going to play it right now. Um, it just, it's amazing footage that you got. Thank you for, um, for doing that. And again, if you want to find out more about Connor's photography, go in the link below and, um, you know, again, you won't be disappointed. Okay, hey, thanks a lot, Connor. Thank you.